I just want to say, I don't like these lights. I love these lights. The other Eagle LEDs were pretty awesome, and they still are awesome. One of the best lights on the market, bar none. But these things make them look like regular headlights. I'm just so impressed. And this video is not even doing it justice. It is so bright. So I highly recommend the Diamond Brights if you're looking at LED lights. Uh, totally blow me away. LED Eagle Diamond Bright, they call it. It's an XD14 uh, LED bulb. There's only a hundred manufacturers using this technology, and they are one of them. And they're a Canadian company, which is uh, which is super important. Customer service is second to none. Right from the minute you open the box, you know this light is different. It has a really good instruction manual in it, in English as well, because it's a Canadian company. Very, very easy to understand. And yet, when well, the first time I opened this, I was like, wow. Yeah, these are crazy. Like, the quality of these things is unbelievable. It's all aluminum. Where my Moto LEDs look similar, they were plastic. Even this here resistor part, that's an aluminum body on it. It's insane. And I like this as well, which, uh, which you know, if there ever was a problem to happen down the road, you've got the ability to swap out either this component or that component, or even if it's servicing a vehicle, if you have to take the grill out or whatever, if it's in a car, that might be something where you can just quick disconnect without removing the whole assembly out of the, uh, the headlight housing. And then that snaps in like that, and you have this waterproof um, connection that threads in nice and firm. But the quality of everything is insane. Like, I don't know whether you can see the cable on this thing. Wow. Apparently it's a double ball bearing fan and it can spin up to 12,000 RPM. It's like twice as fast as a generic fan. And it's, you know, it keeps this light bulb 60% cooler than, than anything else on the market, which is great. Cause that's it, heat protection for all your components around it. But, It'll also make that bulb last longer. Check out the reflector here too, that's insane. And if you look at this, it's actually an LED chip. It's not chip on board like my Moto LEDs. It's actually an LED chip. And it, this is a Cree LED uh, with a Philips driver. So it's, it's uh, really quality components. LED Eagle, they stand behind these products. Their quality is, is obviously visible in, in what they do, but they also back it. So right out of the box, if you've got your 30 day um, money back guarantee, it's got a 180 day free replacement with free shipping on that uh, warranty and a 540 day free replacement worry free warranty as well. So they know these things are built well and they back them with a warranty unlike anyone else. It's unbelievable. 12,000 lumens for the pair of them. So there's 6,000 lumens each with 36 watts. These things are going to be intense. Our last ones were 9,600 lumens and it's bright as you can imagine. So I can't wait to put these in the snowmobile and test them out. Okay, so now we've got both the 600 and the 800 exposed. We can uh, swap these LED Eagle, which I love, into the 600 and upgrade mine to the brand new 12,000 lumen diamond brights. But just want to point out a couple things here. Someone said, oh, these heat sink cables, they get so hot, they'll melt everything in there. Well, you can see here, another reason why I wanted to open them up, there's no damage from heat. These things are as good as the day I installed them. And there's no damage with anything else around that, that cavity. So I highly recommend those. And they installed nice and clean, like I said. So let's, uh, let's swap these bad boys out. I'm just gonna leave the boots on it. 
so it's easy to install and I'll take the boots off the 600 because they are identical. You can call, you just pop these clips out of the way and then the light will come out. And we'll just unplug it like so. And there we have it disassembled. Turn around here and we'll go to the 600. Plug the light. mistake in the first video I ever did putting in those Moto LEDs. I mean they worked, they were fine, but I buried them underneath the rubber grommet. I even cut that to, to make it work. Wrong way, I actually melted, I melted this grommet so it destroyed it. So the way to do these properly, and one of the viewers actually pointed it out, uh, so thank you very much, and I confirmed this with uh, Eagle LED, is put it in like that, install the bulb, and then this actually clip, so you install this into the housing, which we're gonna do, and then you can slide this all together and, and it'll be nice and sealed up uh, just like it should be. So let's move over to the sled. So like I said, to start, we're gonna put just the ring in, and the nice thing about these Diamond Bright Eagles is that you can adjust the beam once you install them. I'll show you the, the actual optimum beam on the, on the screw as well. So we're gonna install it like that bulb goes into the boot like so and then we're going to push the assembly together and click it in place. The optimum installation is with the, the actual reflector piece here pointing up. So when we put it in we're going to click it into place with those up. You can actually turn the bulb, click, click, to get it. So we want it like that with the, with the uh, reflector pointing up. It's nice and sealed tight. I love this. Fan LED, this is going to be nice and slick. There, that's perfect. Perfect. Two down, one up. Make sure that's in place. Again, wiggle the boot over top of the piece that's in there. Push that boot around there. Well, you can see in there, you can see the boot is right over the inset piece. That fits so good. Adjust it so that those reflectors are pointing up, which is just like that. And we can connect them. Just like so. Let's fire this one up just to test it. Wow! Done. So these are the Eagle LED that I had installed in the 800 and I switched them over to the 600 e tech That's the uh, low beam. This is the high beam. I'm really happy with these lights. Like they are very good. And then this is the new diamond bright. So this is a low beam. And there we have the high beam. So bright. Low beam. High beam. Low beam. High beam. Okay, turn yours on. And get up, let me sit on your seat. It seems really gray in the snow in front of it. 
It's a white light, but it's hard to describe. That's the low beam. That's the high beam. Low beam. High beam. Low beam. High beam. And it's not nearly, not nearly as bright. I just didn't have that. It's just night and day difference. I just love these new headlights. They're so much brighter. You can see on his high beam how much difference my light makes. Okay. That's the, uh, the test. I think it's a success. I love these. I'd highly recommend them. I'd recommend both of them. But if you want real bright, intense light, noticeable low, low beam and high beam, I think the diamond brights are definitely the way to go. It is so much brighter. If you'd like to order a set of these headlights or any of the other Eagle products that I've shown in my videos, look in the description below and click the link I provided. It'll take you right to their store and you can order on there. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up or click the subscribe button down below.